All right, Shop. Played a big role again in the win. Uh, swept the series, nine zero conference. How's it feel? Yeah, I mean, it feels good. Um, this is definitely the goal that we set for ourselves. So, um, accomplishment. It feels good. A win to win. Um, obviously, you know, we're looking to still keep our bats going and, and build it up for the rest of the series and the rest of the getting into the tournament and everything. But uh, you know, a win to win. It feels good. Uh, a couple of milestones for you. You stole your 60th base over the week uh, on Saturday, on Friday. I forget which days we're in. Yeah. Tying uh, Megan Greenwell for fifth place all time. You scored a run today, passing CC Alvarez in the runs category department. I believe you're six. You're kind of chasing down Natalie Land, the Hall of Famer. You're just moving up the depth charts. I know you don't pay attention to that stuff, but what does it mean? Because you've obviously got to meet a lot of the alumni this year and a lot of the history, and you're a part of this big history here. Yeah, no, it, it means a lot. Um, I was really excited, uh, alumni weekend. I, I got together with a bunch of them and kind of told them that they'd be seeing me often. I told them that, you know, my dad will have to bring out the big tent and for us each year because I want to do it big even when I'm gone. Um, but it feels really cool. They were super happy. I met Cece. She was congratulating me on uh, passing something that I did on alumni weekend. <laughs> she's like, I heard you you beat me on my my uh, milestone or whatever. And Base hits. Yeah, yeah. So she was super excited for that for me. So it's just really cool. They're really welcoming and I'm really excited. Talk about Maddie stepping up there, driving you in there yeah. to get you on the run board. And the bottom of the order in particular behind you, really all really were the difference this series. Yeah. Yeah, no, uh, the bottom of the order has been uh, pretty big for this entire season. Uh, we got a lot of lefties, uh, Justine's mixed in there a little bit, but um, Maddie just comes up clutch when you need her. That's just kind of what she's been doing. Uh, she hits the ball hard um, when, when it hits her bat. I was already stealing on the pitch, so I didn't even see where the ball went. I just saw everybody looking at the fence, so I booked it as hard as I could. So thankfully for Maddie. It, not it, yeah. it was big and not a lot of action for you in the outfield because Gianna and Kmart are doing their thing. What's it like with seeing them there locked in like they are right now? Yeah, no, it's crazy. I mean, they're they're pitching a lot of innings. Um, they're giving us their all. Uh, we want to put more runs up there for them, but they're doing awesome. They're the, a huge part of us winning these games. Um, so them just keeping that, keeping that fight, and getting those outs for us is really big. Helping our defense work for them. So. You're nine and zero in league play. First time ever UCF's been nine and zero in the American Conference. Second best start overall in conference play. You're long ways to go, but a good start. You've been around the block. You know what it's like in league. It's important to get off to a good start like you have right now. Yeah, no, I mean that's huge. I had no idea. That's that's one of the best starts that uh, UCF has had. Um, that just goes right with our goal. Like since I've been here, I've always wanted to win conference. You know, either tournament or regular season. Hopefully this, this year it's both. So having that start is huge for us, huge for us getting into the tournament and then, you know, helping us out after that. How important is it one of the leaders here? I mean, ECU battled, battled hard, played really hard. And these are the games that are moving forward. They're going to be tight games like this. Every game's coming down to a play here or there. That's how it works in the American. You know it as well as any. Yeah, I mean, every, every team pretty much in, in our uh, conference is scrappy. I mean, at some point, either they're pitching or their offense, something about them is just scrappy, and we're kind of learning that, and you can't take them lightly. Um, but, yeah, you just got to go at them as hard as you can. Back on the road now, go to Houston. What's the approach for the team now? Go prepare for that. Uh, I think we all just have to kind of get back to, to us, being us. Um, you know, it's been awesome being home, but I think we got to work on ourselves, um, to take some extra reps, get ready for Houston. We haven't had an away game in a while, our away series. So uh, just getting back in the swing of things and focusing on us, not letting anything outside of that uh, sway us.